Miss Dunn reporting to you live from the Cheltenham Badlands. Behind me you can see what I'm talking about and uh, here's a quick video to let you know a little bit more about it. Let's use Google Maps and Google Earth to show where the Cheltenham Badlands are located in Caledon, Ontario. Cheltenham Badlands where I'm doing a quick little video blog on a really cool geographic form um, that's located in Cheltenham which is just south west of Inglewood. Um, pretty incredible sight to see. I just want to take a second to show you a quick panoramic shot of the area and see if you can notice anything really cool about the land and the landform. So I'm just gonna make my way up to the top of this little hill here so I can get a good view for you to see. Okay, check it out. So as I make my way across this mucky land here, it has been raining so it's a little wet and damp. Um, I'm going to quickly tell you about the Badlands. Badlands is actually its own term. It means the land has eroded and it's been exposed because it's not covered by rock, plants, or other vegetation. In the early 1900s, this land was cleared for farming. So the removal of natural vegetation, along with animals overgrazing the land, exposed the shale to the elements. Use of land grazing stopped in the early 1930s, but the shale has continued to erode, causing the badlands to increase in size each year. Those greenish gray stripes you see, there's differing opinions about them, but generally it's said to be a result of chemical alteration in the land. What a beautiful sight. So here's a little piece of the uh, earth, uh, the shale. You can see here it's um, it's got that red color to it, uh, and it is it feels uh, more like clay than like dirt. Um, just get a close up here of it so you can see it a bit better. But uh, it's really easy to mold in my hand. Um, so you can see here, it's more like clay than anything else. So I grabbed a sample of this um, clay deposit from the Badlands. I just uh, wonder what it tastes like. <laughs> 